Good afternoon guys! This is Celeste and for today, I am cooking for our dinner. And for dinner, I'm gonna be making ginataang pompano or fried pompano with coconut milk. So for our ingredients, we're gonna be using about one half cup of white onion. You could actually use or make use of red onion if that's available. And then I am using a little bit of this ginger that I slice into strips. About five pieces of clove garlic na pinipit. And then I also have one piece of eggplant or talong that I just sliced. And then I have two piece leaves of kale. You could actually make use of any other green leafy vegetables like pechay if that is available at home. And then I have about one fourth of red bell pepper. You can actually substitute red bell pepper into other vegetables like carrots. And then we're gonna be using coconut milk. If you have fresh coconut milk at home, that is much better. So I'm gonna be using about one and a half cup of coconut milk. Then I also have, of course, our main ingredients for this recipe is the pompano fish. You could also use other fish if you would like to, like tilapia or other kinds of fish available in your kitchen. But I'm just using one piece of large pompano fish that I cleaned and fried. And also I'm going to be using coconut oil for this recipe, but any kinds of cooking oil is Okay, also gonna be using other seasonings like salt, black pepper, you could also use fish sauce or patis for seasoning. Now let's start cooking. We already put the pan in our stove and switch on our heat or fire. Added about one tablespoon of coconut oil. Next we will add our garlic. Add our half piece of our onion top and our ginger. Then, for maybe first point, I think onion this is already done. Pagkatapos natin design yung bawang si Kuya sa Kuya, we're gonna be adding our coconut milk by one. Then we will add our coconut milk. We will let it boil, so we're gonna cover it for a little bit. Add salt and pepper for seasoning once it's boiling. And a little bit of patis for flavoring. We'll give it a little bit of stir. Kulung na yung ating niluluto, pwede na natin ilagay yung ating mga gulay. Kagaya nito ang ating talong. Pwede rin kayo maglagay ng iba pang gulay. Kagaya o ng okra. Kung iyan ay available sa inyo. Madali lamang lutuin itong ating recipe for today. And syempre, healthy pa. Pwede maglagay ng mga pampalasa kagaya ng magic sarap. Kung iyan ay available sa inyong kusina. For that, so pwede natin ilagay yung ating red bell pepper. And syempre pang huli yung ating kale or other green leafy vegetables. Don't forget to taste. Huwag niyong kalimutang lasahan kung okay na yung mga seasoning. Ilagay yung ating salt and pepper. Ilulutu na yung inyong talaga. 
talo, at saka ito pang gula. So, pwede na natin ilagay yung ating green leafy vegetable. Piyak na magugustuhan ito ng inyong pamilya. Kaya naman, why don't you give this recipe a try? Itatakpan lamang natin ito para maluto lang ng kaunti yung ating gulay for about 2 minutes. Okay, so eto na yung ating recipe for today. I hope you learned something for our video. Okay, so this is our ginataang pompano with vegetables. I hope you learned something from our video for today. Please give this recipe a try and I hope to see you all again next time for another one. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel.